Kenny J. Kenny J, a very, very good professional wrestler. Bruiser, give him a little hug there. Bruiser says, look at you can handle this. I think Muhammad Ali has extra heavy gloves on there so he won't knock his head off. But of course, we can't be sure. Now, Blassie, he's giving you some pointers how to get in there at him in the midsection. Kenny J pulling on the ropes there. Muhammad Ali ready to go. We're ready for the bell, and here we go. It's boxer versus wrestler. Kenny J coming in, trying to grab a hold here. Muhammad Ali dancing around. Bam, bam. A couple of jabs in there to the side of Kenny J. Kenny J's got him, and there they go down in the corner. Vern Gagne putting Kenny J back. All right, Muhammad Ali comes back into the action. Kenny J's ready to grab a hold of one of the mitts. Ali coming in with them long jabs. Now, Jay goes for his feet, goes for a leg, wanting to pull him down, and Ali's too fast, too fast, moves back. Vern Gagne in there real quick, separates the two. Says something to Ali. Let me tell you, Kenny J is a little standoffish at this point. I can't blame him. He doesn't want to get knocked cold. Look, he's got his hands up in front of his face to counter in case Ali comes in with a big roundhouse punches, which he is doing right here. Look at that. Kenny J powers him into the ropes. But let me tell you, 225 pounds, Muhammad Ali, very strong, very tough. Too bad Muhammad Ali never went into wrestling, right? One of the great all-time boxing champions. Oh, look at that. Ali put him down. Great move. Great move by Ali. Little wrestling on Ali's part. He put him down, and that's very good. Ali, tell him, look at A-Pal. I can do your thing, too, you know. Aren't you, Mr. Good? Kenny J. Yep, that's now, Kenny J, look at Ali's winding up there. We had about 8,000 people in attendance here at the amphitheater. This was shot in the morning at the amphitheater. And look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Ollie, he upset him right there. Terrific. And Ollie pounded him in the ribs. And Jay goes back into the, good, puts him back into the ropes. Gagne is counting. And again, Ollie puts him down. A little wrestling move on Ollie's part. Well, I tell you, Fred Blassie did his homework. Fred Blassie, a great wrestler in his day, one of the greatest has taught Ali some of those fast moves there. Look at that. Oh, oh, down went Jay. He caught him right on the side of the head. Jay's taking another one in the side, and Jay's over the ropes, say. Eh? Terrific. And Muhammad Ali looking real good, real good. Muhammad Ali, real good. Go get him. Ali, Ali. Hey, look, look at that. Look at that footwork. Let me tell you. Well, I, oh, look at that. Fainted with the right, came in with the left, and Jay goes, dies for the leg again. He hasn't been able to do a thing with Ali. Ali's pounding him in the ribs. He, and Ganya's moving in, of course. At this point, Ali must do all he can because Jay must protect himself. I mean, Jay has the advantage, really. I mean, he has to just grab hold and take him down, but it's not that easy with Muhammad Ali. And the bell has rung, and Ali goes back to his corner. And let me tell you, that round... I tell you, I've got to give it 100% to Ali. Not only as a great boxer, but surprising everybody at the amphitheater with his prowess as a wrestler. Took him down a couple of times, Kenny J. Now, let me tell you, Kenny J, I mean, he's carrying almost 235, almost 240 pounds, so there's a weight advantage in his, in his behalf in this particular match. No question about it. Now, Blassie showing how to grab that arm, hold that arm, and then punch with your left. Blassie, Blassie's giving him a lot, a lot of good instructions there. Fred Blassie, one of the great managers of wrestling. Now we know why his charges do so well in the ring. Fred Blassie, a legend. And Dick the Bruiser, of course, one of the great legends of professional wrestling at the time, of course, in 1976. One of the terrific drawing attractions in Chicago wrestling. And here he is in Jay's corner. But I don't know if he's giving Jay good advice or if it's just that Jay's a little standoff. Look, he's trying to protect his face. Ollie's going for that knockout. Ollie's going for the knockout. Now the one of the handlers has put his hand up there trying. Oh, hey, terrific! Did you see the move by Ollie? Terrific! Hey, he took Jay over. He's doing Jay's thing. Muhammad Ali. 
great move on look at Ollie, look at Ollie, look at Ollie. Strong like a bull pulling him in those ropes and that headlock. Terrific. What strength. Ali, look at Ganya has to pull Ali off Kenny J. Can you believe this, fans? Ali got real upset with something Jay did, and he really went after him. And Ganya had to pull Ali off of Kenny J. Wait a minute. Let me see what's going on here, fans. Let's take a good look because we have a Muhammad Ali, a new perspective on this great champion. Look at that. Right. Another end down. Eight days down. Right on his back with that right. Quick right to the jaw. Ganya's counting. Ali's moving over to the corner. Ali's ready for more. Bruiser's up on the apron. It looks like the 10 count. He's knocked him out. Muhammad Ali has knocked him out. That's it. The 10 count. Terrific match by Muhammad Ali. And fans, we'll be back because we're going to show you another part of this match. Next week, we'll be back and show you another Muhammad Ali as a great boxer. And also, we're going to see a little side of Ali that a lot of people never knew existed.